Hey, this is Holly from hollyland.com. Thanks for being here. It is tonight. It's actually New Year's Eve night um, here in St. Louis. And what am I doing? Well, I just got back from Starbucks. I was going over some business uh, things. And I got myself a Caesar salad and some mangoes and blueberries. <laughs> And I will be spending New Year's Eve, uh, maybe sleeping. I'm not sure. But I'm alone again this year. And um, it's okay. I wanted to talk about human design. And I wanted to talk actually about the identity center or the G center. That is the diamond in the middle of your chart. So if that is white for you, <clears throat> then that means you have an undefined identity and the pressure to know the direction in your life and who you're going to love and who's going to love and who, yeah, and who's going to love you is intense. <laughs> um, the cool thing about people, I have an open identity center. I'm sorry, I have an undef... Well, actually, I do have an open identity center. 43 of the... 43% of the population at least has an undefined identity center. And some of those may be entirely open like me. And what open means, it means that you have no little lines coming off of that center. So this person is like fully defined. Um, so no lines, oops, that's the identity center. No lines coming off of that. <clears throat> and that means that I am here to notice who is using their identity well in healthy manner. And who is actually not, which is, you know, funny because the pressure for me to, to want to have others identify me is very strong. And so the cool thing is that as I'm growing and noticing, really it's awareness I am, I'm becoming more comfortable in understanding that other people initiate me in my identity. Oh God, 